Snoop D O Double G in the house. A recent NHL 20 update has added the rapper Snoop Dogg to the game. He will be an announcer as well as a playable character in the world of Shell Mode. Snoop announced his appearance in the game on Twitter, saying, I see hockey really be lit now with me in the boot. EA also released a launch trailer for the iconic character as well. Fortnite's drive-in theater called Risky Rules will be showing a selected scene from Star Wars, The Rise of the Skywalker, next weekend. The announcement had been made across the game with posters, saying that the doors open at 10.30 a.m. Philippine Standard Time, 1.30 p.m. EST, 6.30 p.m. UK on December 14th, a Saturday. The video will last about 30 minutes and it has also been reported that the director of the movie, J.J. Abrams, will also make an appearance. Kingdom Hearts 3 Remind was able to reveal the Final Fantasy characters that will be seen in the game, which are Aerith, Leon, and Yuffie. The playable characters that will be available are Kairi and Riku. Another thing that was revealed at this time but was soon pulled out was the launch date for the game, which is a winter release. The DLC for the Final Fantasy characters will be on January 23 for the PlayStation 4 and February 25 for the Xbox One. Tekken 7's newest fighter has been announced to be the Muay Thai fighter Fakurum or Fakum Rum. He is part of the Tekken 7 Season 3 pass. The third season will also come with a new fighter named Leroy Smith, as well as the martial artist Zafina, plus two more characters that are yet to be named. The character launch dates will be by spring and winter, and the season pass will cost the players around 24.99 USD. Recently, a posting for Minecraft Bedrock Edition for PlayStation 4 has been seen on Best Buy and was said to be arriving on December 10th. The posting has been removed since then, but a screenshot has been received, which had been circulating on the internet. The post showed the car or cross play will be available with this platform's version of the game. Right now, nothing has been officially announced by Sony about this. Old Agent 2 from Nick Walton is a text adventure 
that gets written while you play it. It uses an open all that will simulate an old school text adventure. Players could just use a plain English and get results instead of figuring what type of thing to use to create results. The game will still have or will still has some things, but when it is working well, you will surely be impressed. All the Engine 3 is now available to be played via your browser. Just give it some time to look. The release of Shovel Knight's Treasure Trove update will be staggered according to developer Yacht Club Games. The update will be launching first for PC, PS4, Switch, and Xbox One on December 10th as is scheduled. However, it won't be available on older platforms for the meantime. 3DS players in North America will have to wait until December 13th for the update while players in Europe have to wait longer as it does not have a release date yet. The delay will also affect or affect players on YU, PS3, and Amazon Fire TV. Four of the best CSGO pro teams are out to take on each other in a battle for supremacy in the Blast Pro Series Global Finals 2018 in the Kingdom of Bahrain. The championship will be taking place from December 13 to 14. The top four teams face Glenn, Team Liquid Astralis, and NIP are vying for the championship trophy and a share out of the $500,000 prize pool. The championship broadcast will be live on the Blast Pro Series Twitch and YouTube channels as well as on Facebook and Twitter. Tropico 6 has received two new updates, the Liama of Wall Street and Sigurdad Social. The Liama of Wall Street brings a new story mission to the base game and introduces the broker. Sigurdad Social, on the other hand, adds the new Rio map for the game's sandbox mode as well as a new warehouse building for trading material. Sigurdad Social is available for free, while the Liama of Wall Street is available for purchase on Steam. Yuta Chikorin take his won the 2018 Tekken World Tour in Bangkok. Take was not a favorite, but his strong performance during the group stage proved his non fans otherwise. Take had an incredible showdown with Shoji, a double Takakubo, who is known as the best martial law player in the world at the top 8. He eventually won and led him to take down Sohun. Ulsan Gauding Lim in the finals, this time using Akuma instead of Giz, which he used for the entirety of the tournament. Take said he had planned to use Akuma against Ulsan and won't use him against anyone else.
Firefly Blue's latest trailer for Stronghold Warlords highlights the game's new castle sim features. The game has six new castle academy features which include opera houses and martial arts performances to boost troop morale, torture devices to strike fear and boost productivity of peasants, connecting roads, temples to boost spirit, warlords to boost industry and luxury housing for peasants in order to keep them happy. The mass awaited RTS will be launching in 2020. We've got exciting deals for you today only here at oldkeyshop.com. Try the spectacular tacti or tactical action game, Anti-Squad, which is a free to keep. We've also seen price drop for the intense dog fights in Space Star Wars Battlefront 2, Battlefield 5, and a never-before-seen portrayal of World War II game, and an action first-person shooter game, a Call of Duty Modern Warfare, so you might want to check them out. You'll also get the best discount today on Soul Calibur 6. There is more when this came from, so head over to our details page now and score this while you can. The previously announced Rocket Lag Blueprints system was not received by its players. The new system have been rolled out in exchange for the game's loot boxes. The devs aim for the chance is so that the rewards will be fair and straightforward. However, players are saying that the old system was more rewarding. The old system can win players more items. As compared to the new system, which is only for a single items, also players will want to blow ferns via tradable for credits. The Neck by Shot Games has been announced by 2K Games. A new studio has been created by 2K Games, especially for the called the Cloud Chamber. The theme of the new studios can be found in two locations, which are the San Francisco Bay Area headquarters in Novato, California, and the other one is the Monrails Quebec Cloud Chamber, is being headed by the Kelly Gilmore who was previously from the Paraxas Games. The last Bioshock Games launched in 2013, and the new Bioshock game is still a few years out. Minecraft for the PlayStation 4 has been announced. This will be the Bed of Rock edition. It will be the cross platform as well. The game is set to launch by December 10th, which means that by this time, players will be able to cross platforms play with other players on PC, Xbox One, Nintendo Switch, and iOS and the Android version of the games. This will also make any port chases and progressions available and any platforms and access to the Minecraft marketplace will also be available.
A Mech Warrior 5 Mercenaries launch trailer has been shared by developers of Perenha Games. The game has been announced three years ago and is finally launching today. This is a single player story driven game that is based on the simulations engine that powers the Mech Warrior online. The game uh, can support co op for four players and will have AIs if you are playing alone. Mech Warriors 5 Mercenaries Instant Epic Game Store exclusive. A Jim Henson film called The Dark Crystal has been announced to have the video games which is called The Dark Crystal Age of Resistance. This will be a third based tactics game and it's being developed by the Bonus XP who are the makers of the third official Stranger Things game. In the Age of Resistance, you will be leading as a band of gal filling rebels against their cruel master called the Access the Dark Crystal Age of Resistance Tactics. As set to launch in February 4 for PC, PS4, and Nintendo Switch. The new Football PS 2020 Data Pack 3.0 has been released by Konami. This comes with multiple players' faces that comes with over 30 starts with realistic and highly detailed updates. This will also come with the multiple stadium updates, improvements to the Cicero Pompeo, the Taldeo Old Dom Ford and Elden Stadium, the additions of a new arena, the Grêmio Stadium, is also part of it, a national uniform updates for the Germany, Spain, Japan, Northern Ireland. DreamHack will host 11 sport events in 10 cities across the globe in 2020. The locations include uh, Leipzig, Anaheim, Dallas, Sweden, Valencia, Montreal, Rotterdam, Hyderabad, Atlanta, Winter Savella. The games included the sports events are CSGO, Rocket League, Dota 2, as well as the minor league of Legends. Competitions, you can check out the complete dates for all cities listed on their official site. The heavy metal action platformers game Valvarus is getting a free full metal mode. Updates for PC versions of the game. This new mode is the game plus variant three in which is the gameplay will be mildly deadly. All the player's weapons and upgrades will be carried over this mode. The enemies and bosses or the tanker third gen will receive more damage and new destroyer Plus weapons and new achievement for defeating the new mode will be available. These updates will also be available and consult by 2020. Approaching. 
World of Tanks is getting a holiday oops, which is the biggest event of the year. This will be starting on December 13 and will run up until January 14. Players will be able to decorate a new in-game garage for the holidays as well as to earn amazing rewards. There will be an interactive Christmas tree, a fest as well as the yard installations. There are more than 300 decorations to choose from well as for collections. To be a complete and the decoration as the game can be earned by can, uh, causing distractions. missions and receive small boxes you will find decorations and other pleasant rewards inside the super crash cold launch date has been announced to be in january 16 2020 for the nintendo switch and pc the game is a fast paced stylish brawler from the vertex pop got to play as karen who is the hellman and saving her kitten chops from the Elden Heart Trap, who commands Robot Scar must get her laser blaster, as well as to put in her favorite neon jacket and punish their robot enemies. The StarCraft II Nation Awards tournament have been concluded yesterday in Paris, and for the first time, Team Finland won the finals defeating South Korea in 5-3 outcome. Jana Cyril Sotala was able to win the 4 out of 5 games needed for the victory Cyril along with his team mix Zogelyang and the Moz Zero. Take home the prize money of 16,000 uh, 16, USD dollar, along with the first ever titled and the three demanded 60 editions. Yeah, and Sue's just not ready for this. He's trying to reinforce it to that location, but with this many ravagers, Zuka the Young is breaking through. Sue's gonna start losing so many rushes. His supply is plummeting. Zuka Young is about to put Finland in the lead here. He is about to be so freaking happy. As you guys can see, he gets his revenge. He had to wait for it for more than a year. We get exciting deals for you today only here at thehulkyshift.com. Try the spectacular tactical actions Garamante squad, which is the free ticket. With also same prize draw for the intense dogfights in Spice Star Wars Battlefront 2, Battlefield 5, and never before seen the portrayal of the World War 2. Game and action first person shooters game, game call of Duty Mode Wayfair, so you might want to check them out. You'll also get the best discount today on the Soul Calibur 6. There's more where this came from, so head over to our deal deals page now and score this while you can.